Lemon Frog. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you guys heard that. <laughs> Eric said the lemon frog. Yeah, I did. I hope that actually got recorded. <laughs> yes, I do. Do it. Oh, someone's making a phone call. into that exorcism was an uncharacteristic stroke of genius. Demonic possession is the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> what? Oh, Commissioner. Uh, no, that was uh, Max's aunt. Yes, 14 packs a day. <laughs> What's that? Yes. Oh, yes. God. No. Now yes. I want Sweet to make those random calls. <laughs> story by Susan Sontag. We're on our way. Yes. Our friend the neighborhood am demon just burnt down another monastery. No, Max, we have a far more bloodthirsty adversary this time. The president of the like, United wow. States of America. What? The man's Whoop. gone nuts. He's enacting all kinds of crazy new laws. What else is new? Federally mandated group hugs before, during, and after all major sporting events. Oh, that's the worst. So, he's curtailing civil liberties, threatening the environment. Hey, that makes three of us. <laughs> and he's about to introduce mandatory gun registration. <gasps> Get the keys. That's the final straw. It's the blue one this time. Every opening is a different color. I know. I'm not stupid. <laughs> Adam's just like, I don't know. <laughs> the opening in um, The Devil's Playhouse, which is the third season, was um. <laughs> we don't even have a webcam. I know. <laughs> I'm just dancing. And, um, can, well, can a man dance? Well, you can dance, but just. It's lost. With, vis, visual jokes are lost with no camera. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm not. I wasn't like, oh, yeah. This is gonna be funny to them. I just wanted to dance. Okay, dance. Well, well, save your dancing until later. I have to point out. Sam, and I'm not trying to be mean. I mean, like, you're gonna want to save it until later. And I have to point out that we could have avoided this. Because there's a much better part of this episode. Oh, oh, sweet. Sweet. Jersey Devil, Jersey Devil, and firing your gun out the window. I swear that woman was a dead ringer for him. <laughs> Well, here we are, standing in an open field west of the White House. Whoa. Let's go bring that hammer down on that. That's a nice entrance to the White House. Yeah. Also, I'm fairly certain you can't just drive up to the White House like that. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> because Secret Service is hey, cheap in the face. <laughs> no. Always in the last place you look. I don't, uh, I don't know if the microphone can actually pick me up right now. Adam is perched like Batman on the sofa. I am the night. I am the night. I am Catman. Or if you were, or if you're uh, George Clooney, you would be Batman. <laughs> hey, this phone only takes Susan B. Anthony. <laughs> That's it. Must be one of those stupid five five five. Everyone else is either Batman. Yes, actually. Or five five five. Batman. Or. or I'm Batman. Mention how I've memorized five and Then you got George Clooney who. It's I'm Batman. Batman. Where have you been? You want to write down the phone number? I remember the number. I want to write myself huh? a reminder to smother you with a what? pillow. What? Who is that? Nothing. Just... Okay. <laughs> that's that's how he is. He's just a Batman. Where have you been? Huh? <laughs> Duh. Post no bills. Oh, but he's just a bill. Oh. Sitting on. I love this character, but I can't. But I, I, in order to get through this episode fast, we need to not talk to him right now. But he's one of my favorite characters. Uh, Back to the nice. office, especially okay. after I played not through this episode. Little, uh, and exactly. those of you who have played through this episode, <laughs> you you probably know why he's one of my favorite characters. But even more so after this episode. Okay, I need to go over these posters. Also, I noticed in the Sam Max episodes, like, you can hear the clicking of my mouse. 
Um, I hope that's quieter now that it's not on the table. Give me all you got. Give me all you got. New recruiting slogan. But you have a very loud mouse. What are you, chicken? Is that just a food truck? Apparently, there's no room in the military budget for quality. I think it's a tank. No, I was talking about like the garbage on the ground in the corner. What? Yeah, it's like a little tray, food tray or something. <laughs> yeah! Don't step in that manhole. Step in that manhole and you'll break your mama's, um, mandibles. Oh, wow, wait a sec. That car was totally driving down the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They all do that. Oh, nice. It's like, I don't think I've ever seen a car actually going the right oh, okay. way down that street. I it was just like, yeah. I never really paid attention. I, 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 honestly, I don't know if there's been cars in an episode before this one. Oh. There might have been, I just didn't notice. Is the cheese still in there? I don't think so. I think it's empty. Oh, no, that's right. Oh. Leonard's up there. Huh? That's uh, right. Off of the spoon lighthouse. Mr. Pizza. The White House. Mr. Pizza. Hello, please hold. Hello, please hold. Our phone bill is sure going to be expensive this month. It's okay, Max. I've been paying them out of your retirement fund. What are you doing over there? Is anyone there? Shaking my head. <laughs> Back and forth. But not my hair. Eric would never shake his hair back and forth, and I just farted. Just so that everyone should know. Eric's sarcastically applauding at my fart. No, that was that was your fart. <laughs> oh. <laughs> my fart sound, going, sounds oddly like Eric clapping. We're off to the yeah. White House. It smells oh, like Eric clapping, too. Uh, I wanna be here. <laughs> Help me. Sorry, Super Bowl. I didn't want. I, I didn't want to trick you, but I got to. I got to do it. I Hello. has to know. Hello. What? No, now, I'm just saying. Now, these <laughs> same folks will say that we're wrong for introducing this federal pudding embargo. They envy our freedom. I ask you, what have they got to hide? Unless they're secretly sitting on stockpiles of pudding, and oh yes, we will find them. They've got nothing to be afraid of. So, in conclusion, America, mm. so get back to the Max the Wiki. Wall. Dance, come on, Marzipan, um, and good night. It's worth the this, run, Max. This guy is supposed He's to. Than this guy is supposedly like a mashup of. I think he makes a lot of good um, points. Those Bill Clinton are trying and to steal our George jobs. <laughs> and I especially like how he does that spinny thing with his eyes. He's in no toad. That's it. The president's not crazy. He's been hypnotized. Has he? We've got to snap him out of it, Max. And pronto. How do we do that again? We hit him over the head. Maybe he's like just been implanted with hypnotic oh, yeah. eyes. And then everyone looking at him has to agree with what he says. That would answer a lot hypnotic of questions about politics. Eyes. Da -da -da. Chuckles. Chuckles. Mr. President. Good day, Mr. President. We come in peace, as far as you know. <laughs> Ooh, I did have not. <laughs> did you see that? Huh? The poster and the or the interpreter. I did not yeah. have sex with. That is why you fellas are here, right? Sure, why not? That will. Because I got a meeting with one of them foreign dignitaries. Always talking that crazy space language. Who's back? Keep up the good work, Mr. President. You gotta know when to hold him, know when to fold him. The man's a genius, Sam! I almost feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's for the good of the country, Max. He knows his shit. Okay, so you go to the exit. See that? There. You should have looked at the oh, post. Oh, no. I guess I wasn't supposed to do that yet. Hello. Post. Oh, no, maybe I have to. Oh, I might actually have to get thrown out for that to happen. Oh, yeah? Hello. No, sir. I said oh, he's right here. Abuse. Okay. It's a very important issue. Okay, was he's I? back. No, comprende, son. What was that? I'm speaking English. Ah, oh, are, are you two fellas the interpreters? It's about time. 
darn this I thing. Know, right? We just had a couple of imposters in here. I mean, here. traffic was crazy. Eric, time. Were they walking Chicken. around examining everything and engaging everyone in a pointless <laughs> conversation? Stat. Those are the ones. Those accursed clones. Ten when will their devilish mimicry end? Help me out with this here potentate, would you? Potentate? I can't understand a dang word. But that doesn't <laughs> make sense. That was I a don't potentate. even have an accent. <laughs> Oh no, momento, por favor. <laughs> wow. Little guy, ain't he? Okay. Let me talk to Mr. President. Hello, Mr. President. We're ready to interpret. We're ready to interpret for you. <laughs> All right. Let's get this party started. <laughs> Mr. President, my fellow Americans, I come to warn you about a serious epidemic facing our country. The scourge of soda abuse. Many former popheads like myself <laughs> found ourselves in the Dang endless pop cycle heads. of addiction and elimination until we believed there was no hope. I don't know what you're saying, son, but you're selling it, boy. Good job. I ask you, how long can this epidemic <sighs> continue? What was that? He said. Uh. I don't know. What's a guy gotta do to get a drink around here? What's a guy gotta do to get a drink around here? Aha, uh -huh. I know what you need. An ice cold orange sugar fizz. I swear by him. No! That's not what I want at all! So, would you I say that resist. it's what? orange soda? I am yeah. Kel I loves to orange soda. Kel, <laughs> he does. Do he? Do he? Yes, he do. Yes, he do. He do, he do, he do. I almost feel <clears throat> bad about this. I don't have a conscience, Sam. Oh, so What's your excuse? I do. I try to screw in the, the Jonah. Jonah. Oh, bless it ain't you know that so probably cold. only like three people that are watching this actually get the reference right, and oh. two of them are us. <laughs> no, no, I'm not so much I do, I do, people. I do. <laughs> I need more. I need more. I need Is it true? I need a bathroom. Which way is the bathroom? <laughs> it's true. Which way is the war room? It's that door right over there. But I don't. Oh, thank you. Where do you think you're going? I've come to get in there. Back. Yeah, he's got to get in the You've war room. Got a priority red number two here in the Oval Office. No, it's just number one. <laughs> Escorting the suspect to holding cell for interrogation. Come with me, sir. But it'll only take a second. Please, let me go! Aww. I kind of feel that. That was fun! Mm. Okay, and now I didn't catch all that. What did he say? Eric. I'm I'm gonna punch the president in the face. Oh, don't do it. I'm doing it. Don't. You're gonna miss it. Do it. I'm doing it. Now it's time for some checks and balances. Freelance police. I like that eagle with the money and the gun. Gladly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> look it, fellas. My fingertips look like little tadpoles. <laughs> they just don't know. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it's a damned ugly puppet. Ah, the drawstring. Damned ugly puppet. Our first clue. Our first clue should have been. Somebody poison the water hole. <laughs> I thought hypnotizing. Someone put a snake what? in my boot. Yes. An ingenious device being used to hypnotize the If no one gets that reference that's watching, I feel control. so sorry for you. <laughs> what? You are a sad <laughs> and strange little man. Was like that when we, got here. we turned him into a robot when we punched his head off. <laughs> it was a deep tissue massage gone horribly wrong. This is one of those villains that says his evil plan in front of the, the, the character. Of course. Lower than reruns of Midtown Cowboy. Hey, we were on that show. <laughs> to have to replace the president so soon. Now that these idiots have forced my hand, uh, we're standing right here. We can hear everything you're saying. It's time for a leader that people will have to listen to. Agents Jackson. Who would that be, Eric? We are moving the timeline Dude, forward. Care to guess? Bosco? <laughs> Why would the most... <laughs> Superstitious guy in history be. No one would get a head up on him. He's ahead of the game. I don't think anyone's gonna get a head up on him either. <laughs> oh man. Quite the reaction I would have expected from a Secret Service agent discovering two people over the decapitated body of the president. What do you think this fake body is made of? Can I keep it? No time for that now, Max. We've got to stop them. 
Wait, what, what do you want, want it for? <laughs> <laughs> well, you gotta have a man suit, Eric. Clearly. <laughs> Why are you wearing that stupid looking man suit? <laughs> Mr. President. Listen, scuba diving boot on a banana boat with cocktail onions and a map to the stars' homes. Yeah! They reanimated America's most beloved president. I always thought Taft was shorter. Not Taft, my My fellow Americans, I am Abraham Lincoln. As you know by now, your president was recently murdered by two mysterious interpreters. But turn not to fear and despair. I have returned to guide us through this troubled time. Back to Mars. A vote for me is a vote for Abraham Lincoln. I get it! What's that? Uh-huh. Lincoln Memorial. Right. Hydraulic motors and robotic implants. Yes. Okay. I see. We're on it. Wrong number? That was the commissioner, Max. If this new Mecha Lincoln wins the emergency election, the nefarious forces controlling him will have unchecked so much power talking. to destroy the entire free world. I hate when they do that. I don't remember. That's why one of us is going to have to run against him. Really? You got to answer so... the phone. Okay, fair's fair. Max, we're Dial going to make you the next president of the United States. Yes! Hey, there's the next star. Yeah, there is. <laughs> What time is it? Do we need to stop? Time to party. That doesn't answer my question. Because it's time to stop. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see. Well, that's the end of this episode. Sorry we didn't talk a whole lot. We we're trying to get over the fact that there's a giant statue of Abraham Lincoln that suddenly came to life and is now running for president. And it's leading us back to Mars. After That's leading us back to Mars after we punched the head off the current president who turned out to be a robot. When we, when we punched him, he turned into the robot. So it was always a robot. Yeah. He just okay. magic like just when we punched the set off. Look at that split second. He turned into a robot. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty impressive. I know. So what happened to the real one? Um, peaches. I never did trust peaches. <laughs> Wanna know why? They look like butts. <laughs> Cause they got pits. <laughs> 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 they got pits. <laughs> All right, next time we will run against Abraham Lincoln and we will make Max president. Bubblegum nightmares. <laughs> <laughs>